everyone, welcome to Sweet Pieces Inspirations. My name is Sydney and today we are going to learn how to do the Little Cones crochet stitch. This is a simple two row repeat. All you need to know how to do is a single crochet, a chain one and a half double crochet. I am going to be using US turns and you are going to chain up an odd number of stitches plus one. You can do a plus two if you would like. I have found doing the chain two kind of keeps it from pulling so much. Um, so we are gonna start on the very first row repeat. Um, I am not going to be working on in the chain stitches, but we're going to count this as where I'm where my half double crochets are. We're gonna count that as my um chain stitches so if you would like to do the um, chain one or chain two at the beginning that is completely up to you after you have all of your odd stitches counted for but we are going to start off in the very first stitch and we are going to place a single crochet we are going to chain one we are going to skip one and in the next stitch we are going to place a single crochet and that is what we are going to continue repeating for the remaining of the first row repeat is we are going to chain one skip one and in that second stitch or the next stitch we are going to place a single crochet chain one skip one and then single crochet so go ahead and repeat that until you have reached the end and you should leave off with a single crochet and for the second row repeat we are going to chain two turn our work and each of those single crochet spaces or not single crochet but chain one spaces we are going to place two half double crochet stitches into those chain one spaces so go ahead and continue placing the two half double crochets in each of those chain one spaces until you have reached the end of the second row repeat. And once you have gotten to the end of your second row and that very last stitch, which is going to be our chain space from the previous row, we are going to place a half double crochet. So go ahead and continue repeating those two row repeats until your desired length. And this is about what you should have um, once you have gotten completed if you did enjoy this tutorial please don't forget to give this video a like share comment or subscribe i hope you all have a wonderful day and i will see you guys next time